Hi everyone, welcome back to Jerusalem's Playroom. My name is Jamika and I want to show you guys a very small haul that I have here. Not too much, not a big haul. I've been trying to cut back a lot. I pray that you all have been doing well, great. I pray that everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving with your family and friends. Um, I had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I, it was small. It was just uh, my immediately family immediate family came over so anyway we had a really good time i was tired <laughs> i woke up kind of late then i just took a nap and so now i said let me go ahead and do a video and show you guys some little items that i got and i'm gonna start with the first item i am holding him in my hand this is um what did i name him i think i named him jelani yeah i named him jelani and he is wearing this little outfit that I purchased. It reads, My Mommy Welly Loves Me. And here he is. And it, I just bought some little blue pants uh, to match it. And this hat was a hat I also thrifted a while back. He is one of my uh, Reborn dolls that I think I bought off of Reborn.com. And I got them in... I just really like his little small face and I like to put little hats on him. But anyway, I thought this outfit looks really cute on him. He is supposed to be a preemie kit. I do not know uh, the name of this kit, but he does take a magnetic pacifier. But I just wanted to show you guys this outfit that he's wearing in a size newborn. So let me put him down and get into the other items. <clears throat> now, um, I did go look into their toy sections and I found some things. I left and found some other things. So we're going to start with this first thing here. Um, this big plush um, Eeyore, I got this for $3.99. Guys, when I saw it, I was just like, oh, this would be great to put on a bed. If someone is doing like a Winnie the Pooh themed nursery, you can get go to your thrift stores and collect things like that. But the tail does come off. <laughs> But it's attached right here. But I just thought it was really cute. So I went ahead and got this to add it into my collection. And let me sit him over there. Then I got my grandson some pants. Um, anytime when I find these, I just go ahead and get them. He had on a pair yesterday, <laughs> a brown pair. But I found this burgundy type of color and these khakis. And I'm just going to clean these up. Uh-oh. I'm just going to clean these up and find a shirt to uh, match with them because he needs some clothes since he's growing. So every time I go, I try to get him a couple of little items. Then I saw uh, this. I wasn't going to get it, but I've been really kind of getting into vintage clothing. So it was $5, but it is a zero to three months. Um, it looks kind of big, but I don't know who's going to wear this. Um, baby girl journey probably can wear this. Um, it has the snaps at the, at the bottom. And I just love that embroidery detail, um, on that. And I just think the, things like this are cute, especially, um, for parents who save things like this. And if they have a daughter or a granddaughter, you know, you can have photos taken. So I got that. Um, here, I live in the state of Alabama, for many of you who do not know. So, we do have a rivalry game on tomorrow, Alabama versus um, Auburn. And when I saw this, I, I immediately put it in my cart. It's an authentic baby jersey. This one here is a size three to six months. So, when I got it, I just immediately put it in my cart. And I just thought this looked really good. So, I'm not sure which baby I'm going to let wear this. I know Jahari may... He probably can wear it, and even one of the girls can wear it. It's like a gender-neutral uh, onesie. <clears throat> then I got some little socks. If I see these, I'll go ahead and get them because I never can collect enough socks. So I have so many, so I thought these were really cute. And for my toys, guys, what I got, um, I saw her. I do not know her name, but I checked her hands. And I like this particular thrift store because they do not uh, bag their dolls, which is great because you can see if they have their hands or not. So she does have her hands and I got her and I'm going to uh, clean her up and redress her. Um, I paid about $2 for her. Then I also got this cute little um, hippopotamus. I think her name was Nurse Hammy. I could be wrong, but I got her... Uh, because I do have some docking stuff and stuff. And just in case if I want to do a um, 
photo shoot, I can put her in there with one of the dolls holding her. And I found another Suri doll. <clears throat> this one here, I think she was $2 also. Yeah, she was $2 also. So I got another one of her and glad of that to add her into my collection. And as many of you can see, I don't know if you can see, but I do have a Black Panther shirt on today. <laughs> Then I got this cutie here. Um, I thought she was a figurine. She was, uh, well, I thought she was a Christmas ornament. Let me say that. But I got her and I saw her and I just loved her little, um, her little cute face here. So I went ahead and got her and I said, I really got it because I said, maybe I can take the dress off of her. But I was like, no, she has a cute little face and she is porcelain or ceramic. I can't really tell the difference, guys. So I do apologize about that. But I just thought she was cute just to have um, as a little display or something like that. So I got her. Then um, I was looking in their blanket section and I do collect blankets if I see them. Um, this one here is a just a little My Little Pony Rainbow Dash. And I think I paid um, $2 for this. So these are good just to um, like uh, if somebody, you know, a baby come over and I want to wrap the baby up or something like that or lay, lay the baby across my bed. This is what I do. I just use little blankets and stuff like that. So I just wanted to show you. It's not a twin, but it's just like one of those little small little fleece blankets. So I'm glad that I got that. Then, um, final thing I got, they had several guys. Well, actually, they had two. One was $10, and it had the little um, stuff at the bottom where you can put clothing in there. I actually have, let's see, one, two, three. This is my fourth um, baby crib that I have. And what I was going to do is I was just going to style it up under my Christmas tree. I paid $7 for it, guys. It's in great condition. I just like that. You know, if you order something like this online, it's going to be more than that. But it came with this little um, little mat and this little pillow. So you can, um, and I'll be honest, the um, bottom here, it needs to be, I need to fix the bottom in here some kind of way because, yeah, it came out. But it can go back in here. Let me see. I probably should have just left well enough alone. But you can always get another piece of cardboard or, you know, like this uh, hard, um, I don't know what kind of material this is. And, you know, fix it in there kind of cute. And maybe that's why they got rid of it. But it's just... It's really nice, guys, and I just got it to have over here. And, you know, you can do a little diaper bag or something like that and give your daughter um, her own little crib if she likes stuff like this. And, guys, um, let me show you um, some dolls. Let me put these dolls aside. Let me put this aside and show you some other items here. I did a YouTube short and I just wanted to show you what I did because I did thrift this outfit and on the YouTube short, I was showing you guys, um, if any of you watched it, I just did, if you were trying to do like a photo shoot or something different for your baby, um, I just got this thrifted this, this is just a ribbon, um, I glued it onto a little clip here with Dr. Seuss. This is just a hair bow. And I just put this on. I had this pacifier. kind of went with the color. And I put this on Jada. I think she looks really cute. The outfit is kind of big on her. So what I did, I'm not sure what size it is. But I just pinned it at the back um, to kind of make it fit her. I Googled, Googled the outfit and i forgot what store it came in they did have it as a set it was thing one and thing two but i forgot which store had these but i was just glad so glad that i was able to find this and pick it up so usually if i go thrifting and i find something unique i just go ahead and pick it up and put it in my cart because i just like to style my babies my dolls in there and then finally i'm going to show you guys emily let me put her up here because i haven't posted her in a while <laughs> and I was trying to do her hair but anyway she has on these boots um I did a video saying that she can wear a size four but she can actually wear a size two the four is kind of big on her so I had these boots and I put them on her with some white stockings and I just 
got this little dress and put this dress on her and this is what she looks like um with the outfit on and i think it looks really cute on her i personally like to put darker colors on my light complexion dolls but i think she is fine with this and i just think she looks cute in it and i just put the little gem sticker earrings on her um so she can have little earrings on and this is sort of like a corduroy it's very thin but these this right here is something that i think little girls could wear especially with this weather because one minute is cold um next minute it's kind of warm and i think this would be perfect to wear pink in the fall i mean yeah pink in the fall in the winter time especially like times like this if you want to dress your little girl up in something like this but i just get my stuff for my dolls well anyway this completes my video i do not have much here um that i wanted to talk about i just had my dolls here and just wanted to um show you guys you know some things that i do and how i style my dolls in the playroom and stuff like that and then yeah, I got Ember here. Where's her pacifier? This is an outfit that I had a while. Oh my goodness. I don't know how long I had this outfit, but I just put her on this because I said this would be something cute for a little girl to come home from the hospital in or you're taking your little girl around family and friends and stuff like that. I just think this is so cute. And she just has a little pink onesie up under here. You can always mix and match it. You can put another color on there or if you wanted to put a red or whatever. I, I just like mix, mix matching my dog clothes. And she has some little white socks. So, and a little bunny pacifier. I had to modify it because um, her mouth doesn't come all the way um, open. But guys let me end this video you guys have a wonderful day you enjoy your weekend spending time with your family and everything i like i said before i just wanted to upload a video to show you guys a very small haul that i did all right well you have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching jerusalem playroom okay bye everybody bye bye